Hey, what's brappin, my fellow Nitro heads? Welcome back to the Losi 8XT build series. Today we got Big F. Let's get cracking. So we built one of the brake cams here, as you can see. This step here is done. Next step is to start building this center brace. Got it here. I'm not going to be using it because I got the carbon fiber one. The reason why I got this is because I don't know if it sells on anymore, but Horizon was having a pretty sweet sale. Uh, pretty much all the option parts for the X series, I guess, were on sale. So I got this brace here for like 35 bucks. I picked up another optional part too. And you bet we're gonna weigh these. Here's the weight test. This is the stock brace. 23 grams. Carbon fiber. 13. Now why should you consider getting this upgrade? Well first off it's lighter. Also because it's a different material, heat doesn't get transferred to your servo as much, so technically it's going to be easier on your servo. And that's why I got it, really. Lighter, on sale, less heat transfer. Okay, 30 bucks, we're done. to the brakes man these are sweet brakes they they got material on the pads just like on a real car how sweet's that now you must you must clean the rotors off see all the oil on them that oil's there so that the rotors do not rust during shipping I mean, how lame would that be? Open up your parts and your rotors and all your metal parts be rusty. So, you gotta make sure to spray these with brake clean. And I almost forgot to mention, do not forget to clean your hardware. That's a must. I'm really liking this. TLR updated the brake pins. Now you can get a hex driver on here and a nut driver. How cool is that? I'm really liking that. All right, I just found another feature that I really like. They have little guides so that your rotors aren't flopping all over the place. They just sit right in here so they spin as true as possible they're not going to be flailing around making all kinds of clinkety clanks for no reason I love this setup awesome the carbon fiber brace is that you have to run a little lock nut just for your air filter hanger it's well worth it in my opinion and here's the finished product ready for a servo then ready to be dropped in the trugging 